As we intensify our efforts, moving forward to talk about the issue that the professor and Mr. Masana were talking about, about inclusive growth, we should work to transform our economy. And I say this advisedly because as actuaries and future actuaries, therein lies a role for you to play, to help come up with ideas on how we can transform our economy. We've got to transform our economy so that we can, it can grow. But at the same time, we need to grow so that we can transform our economy. Now, you are people who deal with numbers. You are people who know exactly what the transformed economy in the future will look like. And we invite you to make a contribution in helping us get to that nirvana. And we look to people like you to assist in the design of a whole number of programs in our country. The National Health Insurance System was once outlined here by a number of students. And I was in awe when you told us about the National Health Insurance System. Now it is going ahead. And it needs further design, it needs further crafting, and it should be a challenge to you as actuaries to come forward and even come forward to government on an unsolicited basis and say we, as the South Africans who love this country, have the following proposals to make. We also, after doing the minimum, national minimum wage process, we now need to start looking at the comprehensive social security. Now this is going to be a quite an involved negotiation amongst the social partners at NEDLEC. And this is where, Professor Jurich, we are going to need clever minds. There is a greater appreciation of the value of actuaries that they can bring to development and to developing policy a function of planning. And this is what we invite you to come and do. There is a greater appreciation of the importance, obviously, of statistics, modeling, and risk analysis. And there is greater appreciation of the role that each one of you has to play in transforming not only our economy, but also our society. And as actuaries, a profession that is not much known by many people in our country, you cannot hide behind your desks. You cannot hide behind some cocoon. And you cannot be bystanders.